Oh, hello. It is Boxing Day today. So Merry Christmas to everybody and Guten Rutsch, as we say in German. So good start to the new year when it comes. Um, got a little bit of time between the years and I wanted to uh, work out how to do chases on the Blade Runner system. And one of the problems, of course, is that people make their choices for the uh, maneuvers that they make. So the, without the other person seeing. And that is something that um, you can't very easily do yet. And uh, you could possibly do it with a card functionality. I, to be honest, have not actually understood the card functionality in Foundry fully yet. I find it very confusing and it's hard to test by yourself um, because you can't really see what the other people can see. Um, but there's maybe another way. And this is um, leveraging a, a module I came across called Easy Pulls, and it almost does what uh, I would require it to do. Oh, chases. Let's have a look. As last time I have here on my on my right hand side, I've got the player. On the left hand side, I've got my uh, GM view. And um, let's say we have a, a chase and they're currently, I don't know, here and here. Doesn't really matter. This is my player. Yeah, yeah. So the player on the right hand side is this chap here. And um, yeah, it doesn't really make a lot of sense like this. So you have to sort of put them some <laughs> yeah this chart doesn't work very well for me yet either but let's let's assume that they're like this doesn't matter really matter they're chasing so easy pull basically what it allows you to do it allows you to create a poll and um one thing you can do is you can just type into your chat window sgm slash poll let me make the interface a bit bigger again so you can see it a bit better uh maybe a bit too big like that poll and just hit enter and it comes up with this little configuration thing and you can basically say okay i want this to be a result that i only as i the gm can see or everybody can see you can choose it here yeah or you can say people can vote for more than one or not here of course we only would have to have one and it can be open or secret so yeah votes are shown to the players or they're not shown to the players so i could actually do secret ballot down here, for example, I could then say, okay, option one, option two, option three, option four. And I'm not going to actually go through this and rename them all. But if you remember the rule book and I just closed it, um, I copied it out here in rules reference. You have the chases. There are basically six maneuvers you can do. There's pursue and flee, there's hide, there's block, cut off, stand and shoot, or other six maneuvers. Some of them are only available to the prey, so the person being chased. Some of them only to the pursuer, the person chasing. Or actually, some of them are uh, available to both. So having all this text available to the players, of course, is necessary. So you could have this linked. Um, and let maybe just should actually do that. Chases. Um, don't know whether this is going to work. I'll try it later. But what is, basically, you now have four options, and you could type out here what the options are. Six options, sorry. Five, six. So you could have up here, you could have flee, chase. Yeah, and you could type them all in and then basically post it to the players. I'm going to show you shortcut, that's why I'm not going to do that all now. It's boring to watch. So I, when I'm ready here, I can then go, let me just zoom this player in as well. You can then go and create the poll and you can see here on the GM on the game masters uh, you get the options listed who many how many were voted for by each and then as a player I just get the options and as soon as the player clicks on for example flea chase I then get here flea chase now for the scenario I need to know who does what and the only uh, thing that has recently been added actually to easy poll that indicates this is you see this colored dot and this colored dot basically corresponds to the color of the player. I can, however, also hover over it and that will pop up a mouse over. It's a bit small for you to read, I guess, if it even comes up, saying player two. So this actually would allow me then, if I, once everybody has voted, of course, as GM, I would have to decide as well first, and I need to be honest because I can't actually vote on this. You then can turn the results public and everybody can see what everybody else is doing. They can then click on toggle display, but they only see how many uh, voted for each, not who. But as a player, as a, as a GM, I can see who voted for that. So that's actually a quick way that potentially could work for this sort of chase scenario. 
just the cards as far as I can tell, I'm not on the system yet. Um, I put a feature suggestion into the GitHub for Stefush. So maybe um, he can come up with something, but this is a shortcut in the meantime. Now, if you're anything like me, I don't want to sit there and generate a poll every single time there's a chase or every round of a chase even, because he would have to do this every round again, right? Yeah, choose the next maneuver. So instead of doing this, the other option you can do is you can create a, a chat message with slash p and then behind that put all the options in. And if you can do that, you can turn that into a macro. So I've created a macro here, um, chase choices, and it's very simple. And it works, of course, for anything else you want to use the system with. So it says, what maneuver will you make this round? And then I put in pursue, flee, both hide, prey, block, prey, cut off, pursue, so people know what to choose when. Um, and then when I just hit this macro down here, it automatically pre-populates the, um, the options for me. So if I now go to create, GM only, no, let's, let's do it secret, create. The same thing happens, but I didn't have to type it all in. And that's the key for me. Yeah. When I found out that you could actually say basically just from the chat message, pre-populate the whole poll, I thought, oh yeah, this could actually work. So this works the same as you can see, it's only one option and I get a live update over here. So keeping it nice and short again, I think like this, this could work. There's just one thing I wanted to try and that is whether I can actually post without making it a message, a link to the rules reference. Um, I have not tried this before, so this is completely fresh. But if I include it up here, a link to that page in the first line, which is the title line, I, it might work. So I would go to my rules reference, where I've got the chase page. I to arrange it chases. And if I stick the reference in there, will it work? Will it let me do it? I'll just make it a bit bigger so it can actually work. Will this work? Can I put a page, page reference in there? No, I cannot. Oh, that's a pity. Because that would have been really cool to just put that in. Um, maybe there's a way. Maybe I'm just too dumb for it. But yeah. There you go. That's what uh, poll, easy polls can do. If you want to look for it, it's called easy polls like this. Matthias Clemente. I'm just guessing how I might actually be pronouncing this. Let's put this up as version 10 and a version 9 version of it. There's a little bit of a, an explanation in the screenshots if you want to look it up. And it's easy to find the GitHub as well if you want to find out what's going on here or make some extra suggestions on the GitHub. So thank you very much to Mateos, and I hope you found this useful as ever. Take care, and I'll speak to you soon.